I, I grew up in Cocoa Falls, went to St. V, then I ended up going to Ohio State, the Ohio State University, took uh, engineering school, uh, graduated with a computer science degree, and then went off to uh, Avery Dennison, uh, you know, the hello my name is people. And so in, in 2000, I joined RBB, and in 2005, I became the CEO, and in 2007, I became the owner. I really liked the mojo that was within the company. Um, it, was, it was transparent, there was some transparency there. The company shared its uh, financials with its employees and this was happening back in uh, the 80s, uh, long before I got here. So I really thought there were some good bones to work with here. There was also some tremendous growth within the, uh, at that time in 99, 2000 and uh, they needed my kind of help. So I thought I could both contribute to the organization and also be part of a great organization that was growing. We were always called when heroics were necessary. <laughs> when the hard stuff, the high hassle factor stuff, the small batches that were unexpected, that's when we were to be called. What I decided to do was stop competing for the, uh, what our competitors and, and friends in the industry decided was their bread and butter and really rally around this small batch, what used to be called job shop type work. And so over the next couple of years, 2007, 2008, we embraced small batch only work, which includes a lot, of, a lot of new products, a lot of legacy products, a lot of second tier product lines, a lot of prototype work that comes and goes. Um, for us, it's all about having a large portfolio of things that we can do on a regular basis. That's where our growth has come from, uh, to the point now where we're actually leaving this facility and moving across town here in Worcester, and we're growing uh, our, our space by 50%, getting a whole new offices, uh, high-speed internet, uh, much higher than we are now, going to fiber optic, so that we're ready for the future. This is where my passion lies, is creating an environment that I want to come work for. People are, are giving up lots of other opportunities to walk through our doors every day, and so I want them to feel excited, I want them to feel connected, I want them to feel as little stress as possible, and at the same time feel like they're doing really good work, really hard work, and walking out of here with a feeling of satisfaction.